Hey, what is up guys? Just wanted to give you a resource for reminders on the power foods. Um, so we'll walk through that quickly here. Hopefully you got this from your coach or from me. Um, let's start quickly here. So on the, the first page and where this comes from is Trevor Cashy Nutrition. Um, if you have not heard of Trevor Cashy, uh, it's not a surprise. Typically it's about five grand to work with them as a one-on-one -on -one client. And so you see typically professional athletes, um, people who are celebrities or, or have the resources to get that appointment, work with him. Um, and very smart dude, very fun. And um, in addition to having a doctorate in biochemistry, holds a world record as a strong man, very smart guy. And um, like two other things just to, to build up who he is and where this list comes from. Um, any <clears throat> food that, uh, any, I guess, supplement you see in a Whole Foods that's white labeled by them. So somebody else created it. They just put their brand on it. Um, he's one of the brains behind it. And he's one of the three authors for Precision Nutrition. Um, so has done a lot of cool stuff. But this food list is um, from him. And it's a elimination diet food list. Basically, the, the whole list here, getting rid of stuff. There's, there's autoimmune things on here but a lot of allergen or <clears throat> and or um, stress response things go away when we switch to these foods. So that's what this list is about. And basically the, the short version of this, if it's on the list, you can eat it. If it's not on the list, don't eat it. There's one exception to that and that is salt. So um, if you eat salt, that's fine, but you won't see it on the list. Outside of that, um, stick to the list. So this is the most strict version. We also see the fastest results, better recovery. Um, and so, yeah, we're because it's a, a short month, we're sticking to this. So on here are the proteins. And following the list of that category, you'll see these barcodes. And those are used in my fitness pal. There should be a... Uh, video related on how to track that if you've never used it before it's pretty simple um, and you'll plug your macros into there now i'm going to call out here on the fruit page an example so we've got um avocados bananas berries and you can read it all um let's call out avocados right if you make your guacamole with avocados and i'll commonly use um, balsamic vinegar from the grapes because it's only grapes and use that and then down here on the bottom you've got plantains you can find plantain chips so um, between that chips and guac you're good to go if you made it yourself but if you go to chipotle or a restaurant and they've put onions in there and garlic lime you don't know what went into it it's probably not on plan so um, just be aware of that okay so there are the fruits, here's the veggies. It is not super limiting, you just need to plan a little bit to get it. And to, to be on the list, here are starches. And then oils. So here is, I said salt was the exception, here's another one. Um, you see the olive oil on there. And um, olives are not, but you would see coconuts and avocados both in the fruit section because it's extra virgin olive oil, um, it's processed in a way uh, where you're good to go, okay? And then for spices, this would be the cheat code of are you sick of something? We'll just change how you cook it, change its profile flavor with a different spice. That should help you tremendously. And here are the teas. That would be the substitute for whatever you're drinking um, that is not water, right? So if you are, in a caffeine habit right now, the licorice or mint tea would be the best. Uh, dandelion root um, is going to make you go to the bathroom, but there's some caffeine there, so just be careful on that. Um, anyways, there's the power foods, and if you've got questions, ask your coach. Put it in your check-in so we can address it. We're here to support you. Um, that is it. Thank you, guys.